guys and welcome to my 20 week update. This week I have found out the, the sex of the baby and I also have a few more symptoms to kind of introduce and talk about. So let's dive right into it. Um, so my app says that uh, the baby is 10 and a half inches long or 26.7 centimeters, the size of a bok choy and weighs almost three fourths of a pound. So we're getting a little bigger getting bigger in there. All right, that was super weird. The camera just like slipped, started slipping. Anyway, I had my ultrasound appointment today um, and I found out that the baby is a girl. So I'm having another girl. Here is a picture of her. You can see her little head profile and her nose and her mouth over there. Um, right now she is head up, so her head is more over on my left side and then her feet are down dancing on my bladder and I can definitely feel that um, and they also said at this appointment that sh I'm closer to 22 weeks pregnant instead of 20 weeks so this is actually more of like a 22 week update um, <clears throat> so anyway my new due date is June 8th however my mom's birthday is on the 7th and she wants me to have the baby on that day so fingers crossed that I can have her on the 7th but my new due date is the 8th and then, so moving into some symptoms. So I felt, definitely been feeling a lot more movement. It's very strong now. I can definitely tell that it's like a kick um, instead of just like kind of flutters. Um, and I, it's even strong enough to feel on the outside. I ha have had Naomi put her hand on my stomach and she can feel, she can feel the baby kicking. So that's really cool. Um, I've had an aftertaste, a weird aftertaste. No matter what I eat or drink, I've got a weird aftertaste in my mouth. It just leaves this gross, I don't even know how to explain it. But um, that's why I'm always chewing gum <laughs> in my vlogs because um, that's just the only way to get rid of it, aside from brushing my teeth six times a day, but that's not very practical. So I just have been chewing lots of gum um, I've also been living in the bathroom already. <laughs> like I feel like I, I go to the bathroom and then like five minutes later I have to pee again. And it's, it's really annoying. But once again, part of the deal here, and like I said, I think it's part of her positioning. Like I said, literally I saw on the ultrasound my bladder and her feet were like right, like squishing it. Like you could see her moving and squishing my bladder. It was, I was like, awesome. <laughs> that explains a lot. <laughs> Um, another symptom that I've been having is nesting, or I have had it. Um, there was that week where I was getting all the furniture together for the new rooms. As you can tell, I'm in my new room. Um, it's being painted right now. That's hence the annoying blue tape in the back. But um, yeah, so I just had been obsessed with getting everything together. I wanted to start painting. I wanted to start just getting the room together for the girls and for me. And, um, you know, I don't know if that exhausted me or what, but after I had that whole episode of nesting and wanting to get things done, I was like exhausted for like three or four days and I couldn't do anything. That's why the room is half painted right now. Um, so there's that. And then also, I guess, fatigue. I've been super, super tired lately. And I don't know if that's just because, you know, right now Naomi and I are sharing a room. So we're sleeping together. So any noise she makes or coughing or anything, it wakes me up. So um, I haven't been sleeping very well. So I've been really tired, uh, but also, you know, it just feels like you know pregnancy exhaustion. It went away for a little bit, but it's still I'm still just really tired all the time. Um, <clears throat> um, so stress. I feel like stress has really been affecting me these past couple weeks. I've had a lot going on, a lot of a lot to do, a lot to you know, think about, to handle, all kinds of stuff going on. So I just feel like stress has really um, taken a toll on me, even like, you know, that could contribute to my fatigue a little bit. Um, also, I, you know, I just have not, I just haven't been feeling myself. I've been feeling a little bit down. That's why I haven't been putting up videos. But you know, once again, part of the game here. Um, but I have a great support system with my family and everything. So. I've just been taking taking it easy, taking it slow, taking it day by day, doing what I can. Um, and then also, lifting has been another thing for me. As I mentioned before, um, I work in a job where I have to help people um, like stand up from their wheelchairs or you know whatever. 
and I just I have not been able to really do that because I've had horrible pains in my back. I, it even got to a point where I lifted somebody and I ended up making myself bleed because I was doing too much. Even picking Naomi up is hard for me anymore. Um, so that's another thing. Um, cravings. I haven't had any new cravings. Um, there was a while there where I wanted um, raspberry pop tarts, but I mean, it's just, it hasn't really been, you know, a thing to be craving anything anymore. Even the milk thing is over with. Um, so, I mean, new, no new cravings. I've just been eating what sounds good in the moment, um, but I have been appreciating more things that are hearty and salty as opposed to sweet things, aside from the Pop-Tarts. Um, but yeah, no no really new cravings. And then my weight today at the doctor, um, I'm only up four pounds from where I was So uh, at the beginning. So I've gained a total of four pounds. So she, my doctor, is not at all concerned about me gaining as much weight as I did with Naomi, because I'm already halfway through and I've only gained four pounds. So that is my update for this week. That's all I have for you. I'm not sure I'll have anything next week. Like I said, it doesn't really change very much from week to week. Um, but if there's anything new, I will let you know. Otherwise, look for my vlog on Monday. And then I will show you my belly and that will be it. Alright, so here is my belly from the front. My shirt on. And then from the side. And the other side. My good side. <laughs> my shirt up. You like that? It's supposed to be nude. Yeah. It's real nude for me. Not. <laughs> so this side and then the front.